Do you have what it takes to be a space engineer? It's not about the battleships. It's not about the resources. It's not about the gear. It's not about the technology. It's not about the armor. It's about your need to create. It's about you. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Borak here, and welcome back to Space Engineers. Today, we're going to be looking at the heavy industry update along with the uh, accompanying DLC as of course you know Keen is always going to be keen on giving out a lot of um, DLCs to go with some of these updates but you know anyways let's get to it so let's go ahead over to the space station. Looks like there's a little bit of activity going on. Ooh, slow down, slow down. Uh, so what we're doing right now is um, with this update, the uh, heavy industry update, you got, of course, you got the DLC, and you've got... Uh, sorry. Uh, and you've got uh, new blocks, uh, new armor blocks, new industry type blocks, and you get a new um, custom game starting uh, preset. This one's the Pertam, the Desert Planet. Uh, spawn the uh, Pertam Orbiter and it comes with uh, a heavy uh, looks like a factory embedded in the the uh, asteroid there and you got a landing pad there and you've got a little bit of a looks like a transporter Ooh. So, along with uh, different blocks, you've got the, uh, God, this thing really likes to, alright, whatever. Um, with the update, you've got these little, I'll show you here, uh, curving uh, conveyors. We go over into the industrial blocks here. It's the uh, conveyor pipes. And I think let me just pull it up here. Yep, the uh, industrial conveyor pipes are part of the DLC. So the DLC, you got the large magnetic plate, the 3x3x2 plate, uh, in addition to the base one, the 
as you can see right here the small magnetic plates makes for some pretty cool uh, landing gear actually actually turn you back on that's why it was rolling okay we got a little rover here spacesuits and stuff oh <laughs> and you know how Keen was uh, teasing this big red button yeah it's not part of the uh, base update it's part of the uh, DLC so if you wanted the big red button yeah that, that it's part of the uh, DLC so big red button Uh, is not included, which is a bummer. Anyways, uh, so in the DLC, you've got the um, big red button, the uh, conveyor pipes. You got the new armor skin, the hazard armor. Let me go upstairs. Oh, that's kind of cool. sleeping quarters here sleeping quarters on there I'm guessing uh, so along with that uh, if we go back outside just open that again stupid thing we've also got the uh, beam blocks as you can see right uh, that might be a bad example there you got these, uh, it's been a while since I played Space Engineers. Uh, the beams, you've got, um, quite a lot of different ones. You got, you got ten of them. Ten beam blocks to choose from. You got your large cargo, con large industrial cargo container. So we can go into here. That's not it. Uh, you've also got your. Uh, this is the uh, refinery, the industrial refinery. Just a different skin. Kind of cool. You can walk up it. That's pretty neat. You got the little conveyor pipes here. You got the uh, conveyor pipe sorters. Uh, conveyor pipe junctions. Stuff like that. You also have a uh, industrial version of the assembler. Which is uh, around here somewhere. There, that is your assembly right here. Okay, cool. Let's get out the tools. There we go. So, industrial assembler and uh, industrial refinery, conveyor pipes. Not seeing where the cargo containers are. Interesting building. Maybe back here. Nope. Oh, yeah, this is the airlock. Patrol drum. That's what that is. And we go upstairs. They added new music for that um, uh, 
the sounds of Space Engineers contest. They added all those new things in there. So you got the uh, You've also got cylindrical columns. There we go. Jeez. And you got the industrial hydrogen thrusters. The new hydrogen tank. Large magnetic. The uh, large magnetic uh, pad and your large industrial container and that is all the uh, yeah these are all the industrial heavy industry DLC um, pack in the base game the uh, oops. The base game has a bunch of new armor blocks. You got, or really more of panels. You got really small, durable panels. And there's, I think, um, almost a hundred. No, sorry. about 24 different little armor panels and according to the update it says there's about um, yeah there's 64 armor panel blocks a one by one by one small grid merge block if we can find it here merge oh. there the small merge block the uh, two magnetic plate blocks you got your uh, large ship version and the small ship version then you got uh, three different posters. Find a good spot to put this where we can see it. Get your chair. Oh, that's the transparent LCD. Whoopsies. That's the one we want. And sorry, this game keeps freezing up. Uh, I don't know if it's the game that's having issues or if it's my computer. A couple of days ago, I had a really, really bad, uh, really severe thunderstorm with a crap ton of cloud to ground lightning that um, fried a portion of my um, computer it, it fried a few cords luckily I had a, f a good um, surge protector but multiple lightning strikes tends to uh, you know not bode well for computers and electronics <laughs> and we had some pretty bad flooding and probably like a tornado that didn't touch down like an EF zero or something close to that just a crap ton of wind flooding lightning it, it, was, it was nuts anyways we're all good got my computer back up and running still having a few issues here and there but all is well so yeah, we got the uh
There we go. Change interval. Uh, two seconds. All right. So there's one of them. There's the other one. Yeah, they're just different shapes and sizes. So you got the uh, heavy industry, and then uh, let's get rid of that one and that one, and go with that one. Some pretty cool uh, posters. It's not not bad, not bad at all. So you can create some pretty crazy stuff with this update. So the yeah, others, um, according to the blog post and the update. Uh, change log you've got about uh, over a hundred or nearly a hundred uh, bug fixes uh, support site fixes and improvements improved parking brake behavior and toggle power behavior it's an interesting looking update I gotta say but it could be better like you couldn't you could ch uh, charge a lot less or nothing at all for the um, geez, for the DLC But that that's just me. But I do like the new ship design though. Hello drone. Interesting patrol drone. Giant cool looking ship. And uh, so you got your landing pad here, your uh Heavy industry. Oh, there's our posters. Um, factory, it looks like. And you've got stuff on the land. It, this is actually it. <laughs> it's a little lackluster, to be honest. Just one little site on the ground. Landing pad there and small structure along with a tiny rover. But I I, I think they did an, a pretty good job on the update itself. But like I said, I'm not sure if these freezes are due to the game or due to my uh, computer still on the fritz but you can create some really nice stuff as you saw in the uh, opening video alright so we're going to Switch over to my little world of the uh, the testing update world and get a little bit of a closer look at some of these new blocks. So be right back. All right, we're back. 
So you might remember this area um, from the Warfare update. It's because it's the same area. Just a little bit different. Alright, and down we go. I might redesign this ship. Alright, let's go take a look inside. And go to the showcase. <laughs> Seriously? Come in here, and press the button. And then so, it's not very spectacular. I had forgotten to turn off the lights. So you got your really big uh, magnetic pa uh, plate pad thing. What is it called? The plate. Large magnetic plate. And as you saw in the video, you can make it into like a crane. Or like one of their, the giant claws. You know, the claw machines. Yep. And then you got your large um, cargo container. The large industrial cargo container and you got your uh, the sorter and your um, conveyor pipes and for all you Star Wars fans out there like me you could probably put these large hydrogen tanks on as the shield um, generators for your Star Destroyers because they look e almost exactly like them. Not bad. <laughs> and the ladder is useless. Then you've got your um, industrial assembler and the industrial uh, refinery. I really do like this one though. Because you got this little ladder or staircase to go up there. It's really cool looking. Really nice. And then of course you saw my failed attempt at opening this up. Got the uh, the lights, the uh, um, they called it the big red button in the uh, teaser, but it's actually called the vertical button panel. I actually wish they would have just left it alone and said big red button panel or something like that. Anywho. I guess we can look at some of these small panels here. You got your small panels. Sadly, they haven't figured out how to implement some of the uh, um, medieval engineers uh, features into this. I wish they do, because with these panels, it'd be really cool. To have an enclosed, enclosed space with some of these panels. All these panels are alike. Then you got your light armor. The, the slopes and your sides 
the two by one slopes, the really small half panels, quarter panel, and half panel slopes and dips and stuff, and you get the gist with the heavy armor ones. I guess we can play around with the, uh, you got your columns only available in the damn DLC. Um, magnetic plate. I got an idea. Oh, seriously? I, oh, oops, this. Don't want rain. Thank you. Oh, that's a new thing. Parking released. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of landing gear get rid of that and that I think that'll work just fine actually we can probably get rid of this Put a uh, half block in here. Nope. <laughs> well, that failed miserably. I'll have to redesign that later and make it so that you can just walk up in there. Alright, but anywho, that is the heavy industry update. Hope you all enjoyed. And, um,. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and uh, subscribe. And, and I've seen y'all not. Uh, I've seen you guys viewing the video but not liking or subscribing. So if you want to see more of this awesome stuff and put it up in the uh, higher up in the uh, uh, search menu search results and stuff just hit that like button and i will see you guys in the next one take care